Hey there. I have been using LG OLED TV for a while on my PC and I have never really bothered myself with turning it on. If you have it, I'm sure that you can recognize this remote. Basically, when you need to use it, you just click the uh, power button and that's pretty much it. But PC users uh, are used to having their monitors auto power on when their PC is power on, right? So I have been doing a little bit of research to how to start it up uh, automatically when my PC turns on and this is what I came up with. So first of all, you will need to get the IP address and the MAC address of your LG TV. Uh, maybe consult with your uh, router manual on how to do that. Uh, and also it would be a good idea to uh, make your IP address static on your LG TV, right? Okay, let's get to it. First, what you need to do is install Wake Online software. There we go. And now we need to set up uh, a startup script for your computer, uh, which we will do with systemd. Let's call it LG TV on. Like that. Okay. So the first thing you need to do is define service. Start like this. Uh, type of the service. Type equals simple. Uh, simple is basically a type of service that will start once and that's about it. No, no dependencies, no nothing. Okay, so what this service will do, it will execute your Wake Online um, command. Exec start equals uh, start like this. Okay, this is the command that will uh, wake up your TV. You will need to know your IP address and your MAC address, which will, uh, which I will paste here. So I don't need to um, type it again. Uh, but this is the command that will wake up your TV. You can test it just by typing uh, in in your shell wake online minus uh, mi minus i and your IP address and your MAC address, it should wake up your TV. If it does, then you, you can go ahead and continue with making the systemd service. We need the uh, install uh, command as well. And we will need unit command as well. Okay. Once Uh, network online target after network network target network online Target. I think this is uh, maybe this is one too many, uh, but I have placed both of these because uh, if you have an older system, uh, this will, this will have you covered. Okay, now install script. Wanted by. Wanted by. Equals. Multi. User dot target okay so the install script uh, will only start when your system is basically booting up in a normal way this is uh, what used to be in sysv uh, init uh, 
number two, three or four, I think. I'm not entirely sure, but basically this is the this this is a normal way to uh, start up your custom scripts on on systemd. So what I typed so far should get you running perfectly fine. And now let's save this with Control X S. In Emx, wrote okay. Now exit with Control X and uh, C. Okay, and now we need to install this uh, service. System ctl enable. Uh, you can start it now, but it's not necessary because we will do it on reboot. LGTV on service, and voila. And this is pretty much all there is to it. Now let's watch what happens. Okay, now that you have seen uh, what happens, basically uh, this is all there is to it. You will get a slight delay on your system startup, but uh, if you have any better idea than mine, feel free to comment and share with me. I would love to improve on this script. And also I have been having some ideas for making this work uh, on mouse movement, you know, when your uh, screensaver pops in and your TV turns off after a while. But unfortunately, my idea only worked on X11 and not on Wayland, which I now use by default. So if you have any more ideas on that, uh, I would appreciate some assistance. Uh, and in the meantime, enjoy my systemd script and see you in the next video.